Everywhere in America, the fad is to cut weight, but not me. To maintain my stunning sumo physique, I'm going coast to coast in search of the biggest, tastiest, highest calorie food in the country. Hi, I'm Kelly Knighting. I'm a husband, a father, I'm a truck driver, I'm on a mission to become the greatest sumo wrestler in the world. I'm a three-time U.S. sumo champ. I've represented the United States for the last seven years in world championship competition. One night, I was watching ESPN and sumo wrestling was on, and I got goosebumps. I had this epiphany. I knew I needed to be a sumo wrestler. <laughs> In Japan, you're a knight in shining armor if you're a sumo wrestler. For sumo, what you want to be is big. In order to be big, you have to eat. I don't need to start losing weight, I need to start gaining weight. That means I've got to consume 10,000 calories a day. Big, but athletic. That's my goal. So everywhere I go, whether it's work, sumo practice, or for fun, I'm always on the lookout for the biggest, tastiest, highest calorie food I can find. Joining me on this quest is my buddy Trent. He's a professional chef as well as a lightweight sumo champion. But I can still beat him. You know what, I'm damn hungry, let's go eat. All right, this here is the American Sumo Diet. We are done. Woohoo! Yeah! We have trouble finding meals that are large enough for us. We're trying to consume 10,000 calories a day. We eat a lot and we work out a lot. You guys want something to drink? Bacon milkshake? Bacon milkshakes certainly help. Ah! All right, time for a workout. We show our sumo skills to all sorts of people that we meet. Training like a sumo champion is exhausting, but so is eating like one. We ate 2,500 calories for breakfast, 5,000 calories for lunch. Now we're going to top that off with 2,500 more calories. Think we can do it? We got a little bit left. What's wrong, Trent? Now, are you ready for dessert?